What's up guys, Justin here with the RealtimeEssentials.com back with another Unity asset video for you. So in today's video we're going to check out an asset that makes creating medieval villages inside of Unity really easy. So let's go ahead and just jump into it. So the detailed medieval village pack is an asset pack from Astrofish Games that contains a highly detailed set of basically medieval village assets. So um, it's got a number of different assets in here. It's actually a very significant amount of assets that are super detailed and look really great inside of Unity. So you can see how the geometric detail um, really makes this look realistic while at the same time not being heavy from a polygon standpoint. So basically this contains over 200 models for like walls and windows and doors. Um, it's also got like pre-made buildings that you can bring in as well as some very detailed demo scenes. Um, and in addition, there's also a medieval castle blockout pack that uh, contains a number of different models as well. We'll take a look at all of those in a second. Um, I will note this is currently on sale. Um, it's one of the lightning deals inside of the Unity Asset Store. So um, it's currently on sale for 70% off. When that number of licenses is purchased, then it'll go down to like 50% off for the duration of the sale. So if you do get this on sale, um, this is a great deal for this asset pack. If you don't, I mean, you're still getting a great value for the cost here. So you can see there's kind of a high level look at all the assets that are contained in here, you can see how there are a ton of different assets that are contained inside of this uh, asset pack. So let's jump over into Unity and take a look at it. So to bring it in, so to bring it into Unity, you can just go to your window, package manager, and you just wanna find the detailed medieval village. You wanna download that and import it into your scene. So once you download that and import it into your scene, uh, you're going to get a number of folders in here containing the different prefabs, the different parts and pieces, all of that different stuff. And so let's go ahead and let's take a look at one of the demo scenes to get an idea of kind of the quality of the stuff that's contained inside of this asset pack. So you just want to go into the Medieval Village HD under Scenes. We want to pick this last one, which is the Medieval Village Demo. So we're going to drag this down. Let's fly into this scene a little bit because it's got some fog and other stuff in here. But as we take a look at these assets, notice how the level of detail inside of these is pretty crazy. So these are very highly detailed assets. Um, notice how not only do you get um, things like the different walls and rocks and other things like that, but there's also foliage as well as some other miscellaneous things like barrels and stairs and other things like that. And so everything inside of this pack just looks really good. Um, it's probably one of the more detailed asset packs that I've worked with so far. And uh, I'm just really liking the quality of what you get in here. And um, so you, this gives you a really good overview of kind of what's contained in here, but we can take a look at the uh, assets individually as well. Let's take a look at all of the assets that are contained inside of this tool. So the, probably the best way to do that is there's another example scene for the medieval prefabs that you can open up and you can actually take a look at everything that's contained in here. So all of the different prefabs are kind of laid out for you um, in a, all of the different prefabs are laid out for you so you can see exactly what's contained in here. So if we start from the beginning, notice how there's a ton of like wall assets that you can use in order to build out your own custom buildings, as well as these smaller custom assets that you can use to create like walls or there's foliage and fences that you can use in order to add detail. So this really is kind of a complete pack containing a ton of different stuff that you could use in order to build out that detailed medieval village. And then in addition to that, in addition to having the parts pieces, which by the way, if anyone's interested, we may look at trying to use like Dungeon Architect or something like that with these in order to create a level. Um, so let me know in the comments down below if that's something you're interested in. But you can see how you've also got some pre-built parts and pieces over here. And note that this is designed to be kind of a exterior rather than an interior pack. So this is really for the exterior of a village. But you can see how you've got the pre-built bases of houses. Then you've got additional things that can kind of go on top of those, um, as well as the pre-built houses themselves. So these pre-built houses actually come with like the lights built into them, um, other things like that. So you can literally just drag all of these into your scene without having to do anything else with it. So there's also some pretty cool stuff with like um, these bridges. Let's take a look. If we were to drag these into a scene, so let's just create a new scene. Let's take a look at what that would look like. So really all you would do is you would just go into your assets and all your assets are contained in here. And specifically, let's go into the buildings actually. So let's look at the prefabs. So if we go into the building 
exteriors and start dragging these in, notice how these are going to come in with all the lights set up. Um, everything's just kind of set up and ready to go. So all you have to do is just kind of drop those in. Um, it's really easy to do. And so you can see how they really are just kind of plug in place. You just drag them in, they're all set up and ready to go. So you don't have to do a whole bunch of stuff getting them set up or anything like that. But this also comes with the medieval castle blockout pack. And so basically that's a collection of uh, different parts and pieces designed to help you quickly block out a castle. So you can see how this comes with a number of different prefabs as well. So this is a pretty giant pack for creating those different castles. I'm not 100% sure what the long-term game plan on this one is. It feels like reading the developer's page that, um, that he's working on some kind of a detailed or poly style version, um, but I don't know that that's necessarily done yet. So right now it's just kind of the block out pack and I don't know if the detailed would be something that's a separate asset or if that's something that would be a part of this. That I don't know, but I I do know that you get this uh, super huge detail or this castle blockout pack. So if you want to build castles, this could also be a great way to do that. So I will link to this asset pack in the notes below this video if you are interested. I'll also link to my video on the Unity Black Friday sale, which is currently going on. So you can get this and tons of other assets for 50% off or more right now. So as always, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this and I will catch you in the next video. Thanks guys.